You grew up in California, right? Yes, sir. So growing up, like, who was your favorite team or maybe, like, your favorite, like, player to watch and stuff like that? Growing up, I'd probably say Anaheim because I grew up, okay. grew up, like, five minutes from that stadium. I think my favorite player to watch was Vladimir Guerrero. Senior. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, that's awesome. But what is, like, your favorite, like, Latin foods to eat? Can't be tacos. Yeah. I mean, you have a specific uh, time? Um, I like carne asada. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I think kind of style is my favorite. All right, I feel, I feel, all right, if you go to a gas station, what are your go-to essentials you got to stop and grab? Ooh, water, for okay. sure. Got to stay hydrated. Yeah. Um, and some sort of chips, whatever I'm okay. feeling that day. Love chips. You okay. have to nail one karaoke song, Life on the Line. What are you singing? Ooh, that's a good question. It'd be a country song. Okay. Probably some Riley Green. Okay. I don't know, I don't know what exact song, but I, I have a few good favorites of him, okay. but definitely Riley Green. Are you, big, are you a big country guy? Love country. Okay. Yeah. If you can have one artist write your walkout song, who would you pick? Riley Green. Okay. Yeah. Well, like, what are three things you're grateful for in life? Family, my faith, and baseball. All right. I got to talk to you about your faith. You have the Jesus Guan Show. I actually have one, too. Uh, Blake oh, nice. Borkins hooked me up with one. Sweet. Yeah. Um, what, how important is your faith to you? I mean, it's what gets me going. Gets yeah. me going every day. Um, I'm put here in this position to, you know, bring Jesus glory, the name of Jesus glory, and... Um, yeah, I mean, I, I think that's the only reason I'm here is to yeah. bring glory to the kingdom. Awesome, awesome. Um, I've been asking a lot of guys this question. If you do an NBA starting five lineup with just Brewers teammates, who would you put on your starting five? Definitely McGill. Okay. He's tall. Putty, for sure. Another mm -hmm. tall guy. Um, hmm. I'm trying to think. Reese. Reese okay. would be good. Um, there's three tall guys, so we're going to need a little guy in there. Smaller guy at point guard. Point guard. Mm, I don't know. It's a good question. Maybe Sal. Okay. Sal yeah. and then uh, Bryce for a shooter. All right. I feel yeah. All right. We just had the home run derby. I was there in Dallas um, or Arlington, whatever it is. Um, what athlete outside of baseball do you think would hit a home run? What athlete outside of baseball would hit a home run? I don't know. I've seen a lot of athletes who don't play baseball swing a bat. Yeah. It's pretty interesting. Um, I, I honestly have no idea. That's a good question. Probably a football player, okay. I, I would assume. Yeah. thought I saw maybe Chad Ochocinco had a good swing. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Maybe him. Maybe. Yeah, yeah. that'd be cool. All right. Um, what has been like your welcome to the majors moment off the field when you realize you're not grinding in the minors anymore? Um, Probably the first time I ever went to Toronto, okay. which was last year. I think that was the first time I was like, wow, like I'm in the big leagues yeah. getting ready to play guys like Bichette and Guerrero Jr. And I was, it was pretty pretty nice, especially the hotel. Getting to the hotel was pretty yeah. sweet. I heard the Toronto hotel is like electric. Oh, it's crazy. It's so nice. Beautiful there. Beautiful place. The field is great, too. Awesome. If you could, do, if you could pick five players all time, past and present, to do a home run derby, who would you put on that home run derby? How many guys? Five. Five? I'd definitely go with Guerrero, yeah. Bonds. Senior or junior? Uh, senior. Okay. Senior. So Guerrero, Bonds, Conseco probably, mm -hmm. um, Hank Aaron, probably Babe Ruth. Awesome. All yeah. right.